Hey guys. Hey guys. Welcome to my channel. I am sugar. Listen, I've been trying to post these messages all day, these videos all day, and have not been able to. So I just decided to do do it over because apparently the y'all don't need those messages. So I'm just gonna, you know, start with something else. So let's go ahead and if you're in a situation ship, this is for you. Okay. If you're in a situationship, this is for you, meaning you're not with this person. This person is in and out of your life. You and this person might have some love for each other, but y'all not together. Okay? This is a, a situationship reading. Let's get, let's get these messages. All right. All right, Spirit, give me what I need. For the people that are, are in that are in situationship. Situation ship spirit. Give me what I need for the ones that's in situation ships. Okay. All right. Here we go. I'm just going to pull. So let's see what's going on. All right. You got somebody that, that charges in pretty fast. They send you messages. They full of passion. Um, they always, <laughs> they come in and they leave fast. That's what it look like. But um you got the star card this is wishes being fulfilled this is a new beginning this is um pregnancy this is um let's see your wish is being fulfilled probably with this situation let's keep let's continue to pull all right you got an apology or a cup of love that's coming towards you that's going to start this off this person whoever this person is they decided to go ahead and take this leap of faith they've been waiting for a minute but look at here. You got the Ten of Swords. What is this Ten of Swords saying? Oh, this Ten of Swords is saying that this person is toxic. This person is it's, it's, it's either this person is toxic or they're obsessed. Either or, with this Ten of Swords being here, you might not need to take this leap of faith because this new beginning might end up really, really bad. Let me see. You got the page yeah this person is this always you all have several reconciliations all right all right here go the queen of pentacles all right this person yeah this person definitely is it has two people they're dealing with definitely you are one of them um yeah this is this is not good energy at all okay i don't think that this is going to lead to anything serious because this person is very toxic this person will leave and then will come back. They'll leave and go to the other person for a minute and then they'll come back to you. And you sitting here thinking that you all going to have a um, a relationship. But it's not. This person, that it, it's just like you tied to this person because they feel good to you. Okay, so this is some toxic energy that's going to basically end up, it's going to be a devastation. It's going to be devastating stating when it's in it's gonna be hard you're gonna be heartbroken but because your wishes are not gonna be fulfilled and it's not a new beginning as you see this person never really gives you the love that you desire you see that small cup of love that's a page love don't nobody want that okay don't nobody want none of that so let's see yep they keep you in the third party you see them they keep you in the third party to the point to where you always wondering wondering what this person is doing and when this person is not with you you wondering if they with this other person um this person whoever this person is who's toxic they're not at a crossroads they know exactly what they're doing they want to keep on with this connection with you and this other person and you always end up spying on this person trying to figure out what they're doing but spirit is telling you to use your intuition because if you don't use your intuition with this situation this person gonna bring nothing but hell in your life this person like to argue like to be right this person don't like to be called out okay this person is very toxic yes yeah, you 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 feel some regret <laughs> look i just messed up the cars but that's okay you feel some regret when it comes to this person about you know putting yourself in this situation but you in it now i mean you in it and by you being in it you got to get yourself out of it this is this is not a healthy connection at all okay it's a lot of spying lying a lot of regret <laughs> this person um spirit wants you to definitely pay attention to your intuition because sometimes you sit there and you could pick up on the situations when it situation with this person 
And when you picking up on the situation with this person, it's letting you know that they are with someone else, especially when you don't hear from them and when things are not, you know, when even when they with the other person and, you know, they don't satisfy that person. This person probably got plenty more. OK, but you got to you got to come out of you. You got to you got to come out of this energy of feeling regret. Because this person, this person definitely is, is going to try to win and stay in this situation at all costs. They want to win this situation, but, and, and again, this person don't like to be called out. And you see this little bit of love that they just, they give you enough, they give you enough just so you can not be, you know, so you won't be on their case. So you won't say anything to them. Okay. So this is that, you know, pay attention to your intuition. This person does, does not mean you any good. This is for you. This, this person, um, is you know, this this has something to do with um, you and this other person. And this is truth and clarity. This is letting you know that truth and clarity is coming. But I hope this person don't have another family. <laughs> because it's looking like they might. They might they might have somebody else that they really into. And they're just still playing around with you and this other person who's allowing this to happen. And I don't see how you all are queens. The queen of pentacles and the queen of wands. I don't see how y'all sitting up here letting this happen. This person is giving you that little old cup of love. It's like it's like you try. It's like you settling. You don't have to settle for this. You don't have to settle for this. This person, this person, you know, never. This person is always indecisive. Okay, this person is. They, they're not thinking of. They're not thinking about giving you an offer. Okay, they. They. But not a real offer. Okay, the spirit is saying that you did. You know, look at here. The Eight of Cups in reverse. Every time you turn around, like I said, y'all have plenty of reconciliations. They always come back. Even when y'all be like, I ain't fooling with him no more. I ain't fooling with her no more. But y'all go towards each other again because it's toxic. That toxic, this, this, is what, this is what keeps you going back to this person. Toxicity, okay? You attach to, you attach to this person. It's kind of obsessive too. And not only you, it's the, uh, it's, it's the other person as well, okay? But this is letting you know that it's nothing going to come about this situation because this person don't mean any, anyone any good, not even themselves, because they don't even know what they want. So with this situation, y'all need to, you know, take some time to love on yourself. Um, these situations, does they do not end well. I'm trying to tell you, they don't end well. And then you got the seven of swords and you got the lover's card. But this showing you that this person is sneaky. Not only is this person sneaky, they always up to something. They're always up to something and they're making a decision to really just, they're not coming in. This is, this, this night right here done stopped it, because this person is comfortable doing what they're doing to you and because you're allowing it. Okay. So this is that, you know, that this, this situation is too heavy. It's, it's, you've been, you've been doing this for a minute and it's time to make a decision. That's why the uh, lover's card is here as well. And the high priestess pay attention to your intuition uh, when making your decision, it's time for you to get out of this situation and move away quickly, okay? Get out of the situation quickly because this person is definitely, um, this is too much. This is too much for you to handle. And this person kind of sort of does talk abrasive. This person don't, like I said, this person don't like to be held accountable at all, okay? So this is the situation ship reading, okay? You all... You better than this. You don't have to sit here and settle for this this type of stuff. Move away from there quickly, okay? Um, you could be dealing with a cancer. Um, you could be dealing with uh, a Pisces, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, Sagittarius, Aquarius, Gemini, Capricorn. Let's see what else. Yeah. You see all these? Yeah. Uh, uh, Aries, Leo, Sag. Yeah. You, just take some time for yourself and, and figure out what you want. This is not, this is, you deserve so much more than this page of cups. That's just, that's just enough just to string you along. And it's not fair to you. Okay. So let's go ahead and pull these cards up and let's. Let's see what these, let's see what these going to say. This is for your situation ship. Will it get better spirit? That's what I want to know. Because right now it's just in a, it's in a, in a, in a, 
it's, it's, it's in a place where it's not going anywhere. All right. A page of cups. Page of cups. Mm -mm. Nah. We ain't got no time for no page energy. Okay. It's either <laughs> you come with the you come with that king energy or mm -mm. so let's see. All right. Okay, they're gonna leap of faith. This is somebody somebody some, yeah, this person, somebody gonna wanna take a uh, leap of faith or take a risk and work on this situation. Okay, all right, that might be not upgraded to the Knight of Cups, but that's still not enough. Okay. Spirit is saying that you'll do better you'll be better off by yourself. Look at here. You can't make this up. You'll be better off by yourself. Look at look at at peace you are with this situation because this person's gonna always try to keep you in the third party. You see this crap. Spirit is telling you definitely pay attention. Pay attention to that. Don't nobody want no night love, okay? And you know that it's not going to be anything but heavy a heavy situation, and you're trying to get away from that. That's why you that's why you're going towards your wishes being fulfilled. And yes, you might feel left out in the cold that this person not sat up here and and play. You don't let this person play around with you for so long. But at the end of the end of the day, this is your healing part right here. The five of pentacles. Yeah, you might be feeling left out in the cold, but at the same time, this person always try to come back and just string you along with this in and out energy okay and so they're gonna try to come back with this energy anyway spirit is saying you know don't do it mm -mm. don't do it this person gonna always juggle you and look at else you're gonna let this person swoo you with this knight of cups energy when when they're gonna go right back to the page of cups don't do it mm -mm. don't do it it's not worth it it's not worth it. This person want to win at all costs. This person is so full of it, okay? This person don't have enough to invest in a relationship with anybody. This person don't even have the energy to take care of a queen. And then the queen of pentacles came out again, the three of pentacles. This person want to this person want to put keep you in the third party because it's easy for them. And you do make them feel good. You you are nurturer. You you're a a, a, a person who you're loyal, you're loving, you're caring, you're clean, and your money is good. And that's what this person is looking for, okay? This person is looking for that. And, um, but uh, you do have, see, you got the Empress, the Sun, and the Six of Cups, okay? So this person might try to come in and, and present you with these new beginnings and, oh, I'm, I'm going to give you this happiness and joy, and we're going to have a family. But look, the whole time they're going to be guarded. Don't do it. whole time they're going to be trying to, they, they confuse and have a mental confusion about what they want to do. Don't, no, don't let them do you like that. Mm -mm. This is nothing but, but a scam. <laughs> nothing but a scam. Not one ace is out here. You got this empress in, in this reconciliation that this person going, this, this, this ain't nothing but hopes and dreams and, toxic shit that they trying to bring towards you. That's why the devil came out in this other one. Because this is toxic. Very toxic inform you know, very toxic energy that's gonna end up hurting you. It's gonna end up hurting you. Do not take this chance. You sitting on your baby, you sitting on your pentacles. And as you see you got the empress here again. This is that you know that this person just wanna play games with you. That's all they just wanna play games. They're not they're not in any they're not even trying to be in king energy. Okay, so let's go ahead and get you some more. Let's see. Let's get you some. Let's let's see what else is going on with this person. Okay. All right. So let's see. This is if you in a situation ship. This person, like, they just stringing you along. Okay. Don't let this mental confusion and conflict stop you from moving on. Okay. You got your money is good. Don't let this person come in and mess up. Put, bring this energy into you. Um, you know, and if you still dealing with this person, think about getting away from this situation so you can have some peace, so you can reap the benefits of a nice nurturing relationship. But because you're not gonna get it from this person, I'm trying to tell you, you're just not gonna do it. You're not gonna do it. This person that they want to keep you holding on, very toxic energy. I don't like it at all. Yeah, they try to they try to persuade you. They got they got the gift of gab. They charmers. That's exactly what this is. They charmers. Okay. Ego, it's easier to block everything out. I'd rather know my emotions. See there? They're letting you know they're full of ego, okay? Yes, of course. They always want to see you. That's why they have these, y'all have these reconciliations all the time. Oh, I'm done with him, but then he come back. Oh, I'm done with her, and then he, here, here, here he come back. He, she, whatever. 
and then it say finances i'm busy with work right now and it's requiring their attention and of course you miss them they miss you but at the end of the day when it comes to this situation this person don't have nothing to offer you nothing nothing but the energy they giving you they're not they money they money is not even good okay so this is what you're gonna always get because they, they feel like they feel like they don't have nothing to offer you <laughs> wow selfish I love the way you make me feel, but I can't give you the same in return. And that's it for this reading right here. Baby, let me tell you something. This situation ship is not for you. If you if this is what um if this is what you want, I can't stop you. But as you see, this person pretty much is letting you know they love the way you make them feel because you a natural, you know, a, a nurturer and a giver and you have a peaceful home. You just, your money, like I say, you sitting on your pinnacles. You know how to make money. You know how to take care of yourself and you have everything. Why would you, you know, this person knows that, that, that that's the type of person you are, but they can't give you nothing else because they're selfish, okay? They can't give you the same in return. So why would you put yourself in a situation like that, okay? All right, make up your mind and get rid of this person. This person do not deserve you, okay? This situation should be over so you can attract better in your life. At the bottom of the deck, it say in the very near future. And the only thing I'm picking up with this is, if this you haven't talked to this person, this person is going to contact you in the very near future, okay? And that's why you, yep, that's it. That's exactly what this is. Because look at here, reconciliation. Mm-hmm. Yeah, reconciliation because they they going through financial problems too and feeling left out in the cold with a lot of things. So they gonna come back to you because you the one got the money. You good by yourself. You look at here. You straight. Okay, create these new beginnings for yourself. Don't let this person come here and, and woo you. You too. You too powerful for that. I don't know who this is for, but you too powerful for this. This this is what you need. This is this is this is the energy that you are in. This is the energy that you you're wanting, but you're not gonna get this new beginning from this person with this low vibrational energy. You're just not gonna do it, okay? All right. This is the love that they always give you. It'll always be confusion. This person will always be blocked off. They'll never give you a hundred percent, and they're always they will always make promises, but they're always gonna have this in and out energy, this player energy. Because they're selfish. There you go. All right, guys. This is uh, the messages for people that are in situationships. I'll talk to you guys later. Love you. Bye.